Yo, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video. Portland Snowhawks franchise. I don't even want to say Los Angeles Chargers franchise. It's natural for me to say at this point. But um, Portland Snowhawks franchise, we were coming off a bye week, actually. I don't even remember the last game we played. I think we faced the Bucks, maybe? Yeah, we did face the Bucks, and we ended up winning 34-17. to 17, And the losing streak at four games. Actually happy about that. So if we want to win out, even if we do, we like there's no possible way we we'll probably catch up to the Jets. They're probably gonna have a wonderful season. They'll probably finish like what, thirteen and three or some shit like that. And for us to make the playoffs, we have to finish like well above five hundred. We can't have like an eight and nine, nine and nine season, or whatever, nine and seven, whatever. We can't have a season like that. We can't just like barely finish above five hundred. We have to finish well above five hundred. So we have to win. About 60 to 70 percent of our games, so you're gonna have to win out throughout here. So each game is going to be huge. Now, looking at our contracts, the player we want to sign, Jerry Wilson is a player I'll be willing to sign for two years. He's gonna get for uh, two over five, you know, five over two, however you want to say it. So I'll be willing to pay him that. Give him a little bit more. I'm just giving him 6.1 over two, and he's glad we got the deal done. Darnell Savage, one of our highest rated, highest rated, <laughs> highest rated safeties. And what do you need to be upgraded? Your zone, really, your block shed could be upgraded. Your zone is at eighty-two. Your man's at a seventy. I'm upgrade your block shed. So I'm go run support. That puts you to eighty overall. Give me block shed, please. Tackle plus four. That's good because we need our. Uh, we need our. Defensive backs to tackle, I think that's a problem we do face that we cannot tackle. Trey Caldwell, who I believe will be revealed this game. Nope, probably in like the next two to three games, depending on how many snaps you play. Yeah, we're just going to go loose back because that's what you offer us, which is 79 overall. Give me a speed upgrade. Juke and spin, not bad. Rashawn Gary, and we did move the, uh, we changed the depth, not the depth chart, but we changed the formation subs to where we have our outside linebackers blitzing most of the time instead of playing coverage. So our coverage should be better, but then again, you just never know how um, things work in this game. We're actually going to up our finesse move. We said 77. Finesse move, please. And plus one of finesse move. And a whole bunch of other things. Josh Gordon, who is our slot uh, guy. He's obviously a deep threat, but we play him like a... Sh we can get him on shorter routes, crossers. or we'll try to get him on crossers, at least. Curtis Turner, our rookie strong safety, who is about to get revealed also. Not really. I want you to become a block shedding, too. Like a block shutter. Then move him to a 75. Plus two to man and nothing to block shed. Did I not go run stop? I might have went hybrid. And I don't really believe any of these people matter. I don't even want to imagine. Is there a golf? And what do we need? Is I believe your accuracy, right? Why do you miss? It's probably your under pressure throws. Like what would what would give him under pressure throw? Improvising? But I want you to like stop missing your throws, bro. Yeah, it is. It probably gives you under pressure throws. I didn't even see that. Please give me under pressure throws. Oh my god, throw I can see deep and throw in a run. Those are two things I really would do. Really would do. Really would do. The under pressure throws and the uh, throw in runs. We're getting this game against the 2 and 6 Jags. Hopefully they suck. They have Dalvin Cook, Dak Prescott, and Justin Coleman. Dalvin Cook is their only X Factor. Dak Prescott, Justin Coleman is a cornerback. Geno Atkins and Corn Alexander. So they have a decent team. Way better than ours, at least. Thinking about how quick I could like get this series uh out of season one with also with playing all the games. This might get uploaded once a week. Most likely once a week. I upload three times a week, which is Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And that's once a week. I have I currently have three series going. Kind of four, because I do upload, like, GTA and shit like that. Like, just no random clips. I, I'm, I'm going to start doing that, more of that. 
So this could be a, like a once a week thing. Or maybe I would upload GTA on like the weekends or something. I kind of don't want to do that. <laughs> I feel like I'll fuck up my schedule a little bit. So I think I'm just going to stick to like the three uploads a week. And keep like influencing GTA whenever I can really, I guess. Uh, I feel like that video did decently. Better than any of my Madden videos. Not any of like recent Madden videos at least. So yeah, I think I'm we well, this once a week. We're currently in like what week ten. So it wouldn't be impossible to get this series done and get into a second season, maybe before Madden comes out. Because it's currently what May. Uh, next Madden comes out in probably August. They haven't been an announcement on it yet, but. You would have to guess it comes out in August. So maybe I could, by the time the next man comes out, I could finish three seasons maybe. Possibly. Who knows? We'll, we'll just have to see. Anyways, we're going to start today's game with a run right up the middle. And just like that, we're back to insta-sheds for the opposing team. I don't know who I'm going with here, but someone's getting the ball. I'm just not trying to throw it in, so I don't even care if I have to throw it away. There we go. CD Lamb, I believe. Nope, that was actually Chris Godwin. All right, this looks like we should get this, honestly. Why do you never fall forward? I'm going for it. Like, he never falls forward. It's a yard. Please get this, bro. There you go. Like, I ran the ball, like, four straight times right there. And this dude barely got it. There we go. Good block. I'm just trying to make this game, like, a little easy on Jared Goff. Like, I'm not trying to put too much pressure on Jared Goff to, like, make throws. There's going to be a post here. I want to block. Um, Dallas Goddard. I'm going to slant Gordon to hopefully... I don't know what my plan is here. I think Josh Gordon should be open, but if not, I'm going to hit Trey Carlo underneath. Well, our initial look is going to be Chris Godwin with that deep post. All right, we're, we're actually going to uh, we're going to look to see what happened there, because I'm going to show you what I see. I don't care about that pressure stats right now. I'm going to show you what I see. So obviously, hike the ball right at this point. Look, look, just at this point, I see Chris Godwin has inside presence right here. Like, really good inside presence, too. He's about to make a cut to the right because that's what the route is. He's about to make a cut to the right, but for some reason, he wants to go to the outside and make a cut. Like, what? And this is the moment I threw it. I threw it. Like, you, you you, can go back to see. I threw it right here. I threw it the moment he, he was about to cut. Look, right there. This is the moment I pressed the X button. And out of nowhere, he just cut off. And it's an intro. It's going other way. All right. Um, now we're on defense. Now we have no points. Okay. That's fine. No way! What? Did you not see me get in untouched and I could not make... I'm spamming it. You probably could hear me spamming X too. 
Let's blitz, blitz, fellas. Let's blitz. Good fucking tackle. Why couldn't that happen last time on third down? Are they going to go for it again? Well, like run again. I, mean. I feel a run. I feel a run. But there's nobody there. Because niggas can't block shit on this team. And <laughs> we stop them on the one. They can't block shit on this team. And already three for 45 on runs. Okay, so I thought, and he just jumps in for the touchdown. I thought it was a pass. It looked like a pass, honestly. All right, it's going to be seven zip. <laughs> uh, not, not, not the way you want to start your drives. You don't want to get fucked by the game and then, then make you throw in. So, and then you kind of don't want that defensive drive to happen. But nonetheless... We're going to have to come out and, like, bounce back somehow. I don't know how we're going to do it, but we're going to have to. Oh, my God. What space? And there's a hold. You know it's a hold, bro. This team is so depressing, man. Like, we get one good thing. Just, like, we gained the first down. And then it's like, well, I held him. For what? I try, I try, bro. There we go. Oh, good first down, man. You want to see how quick they shut out this? Because you know they're going to shut. Oh, wow. That was actually some good blocks, but for some reason, an elusive running back doesn't have the speed to get outside. Like, are we sure he's an elusive running back? I didn't run this. I swear to God, I picked the pass, but we're running. Fuck it. Right up the middle. Truck him. Since you want to be a fucking slow-ass running back for some reason. Like, that's that. I'm just not running the screen anymore. Oh my god, what do I do on that? What do I do? He had like a step on him and it just underthrown. It's not in the spot it needs to be. Oh man. Wide open because there's no fucking. There's nobody there. Like, I'm not supposed to be there. I'm where I'm supposed to be with my coverage. Like, my assignment is on the left side of the field. And they, like, I don't understand, bro. Like, what, what the fuck? Thank you. Good fucking sack, Grady Jarrett. Please cover. All right, they're short again. All right, we actually get to stop this time. I know I blame Jared Gold for the throw last time, but in a way it's his fault because it's underthrown. It shouldn't be underthrown. That's not where the ball needs to be. But then again, I don't know. It feels like it's his fault, but then again, it's done. There we go. Gaining another first down with the run. The run is coming together now. Can we actually get this outside run? Probably not, right? Are you serious? It was actually a very good run. Took a nice cut inside and just ran to my offensive lineman. And, you know, it happens. It happens. Grabbed it all the way. That's not intentional grounding. I'm out the pocket. Nothing was open. If I thought it was going to be an intro, like I guarantee it was going to be an intro. So I guess taking a second and 24 is better. Can we just like get some blocks, fellas, please? Come on. Oh my gosh. You have to hold on to that Dallas. 
It just, like, it feels like it makes it worse for some reason. Come on. He was open, but that's the only throw I could have made. That's the only throw I could have made. Like, I wish it was, like, not that, but it's, like, I... I'm just under immense, like, pressure, man. Receivers don't get open. I either can't hit the throw. The kick is fucking shit. Oh, my God. God, are you kidding me? Oh my God, why can't nobody catch him? We actually do stop him from getting the first down, but it's third and one right here. We know we're not gonna stop him. We might as well go mid blitz, right? Where? Where was my safety going? That's what I want to know. My safety went the other way. It wasn't even like he hit him with a route. He just didn't go the right way. There we go. Who is that? I can't say your name, but you are my middle linebacker. <laughs> I think I have foot play on on this. Oh, that's a flat. Yeah, that, 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 that's it. I know, I know, I know. Yeah. They really called that. <laughs> we can't stop them, bro. If they decide to run every play, they're going to get it. Like, this is just what it is. They're just going to get it. There's only 14 uh, zip right now, and uh, we're about to ec enter the third quarter, so it'll be nice to get something here, knowing that they get ball at half. And we need to get something on offense, at least three, bro. We need some type of points. Like, we drove downfield a couple times now, just haven't got it. All right, that's a good screen. Gaining about, what, 10 plus yards right there. But most people think it is never a good spot to drop the ball, but the reason I say it's a good spot to drop the ball because the clock would still be running and kind of the clock stop. So, yeah. This play usually works for me on Chargers franchise, but I knew we didn't catch it because I'm stupid. Just a fucking idiot. Can you beat him off this? I feel like you can. Uh, it's just like, why am I getting throw out a sack animation already? It's, yeah, this is over. We're not getting points. Alright, they're running the same play. You could tell, you could tell. So I'm going to need to cover, like, this whole area right here. You see what I mean? Like, I can't cover that deep route and that underneath. It's impossible. Are they running? Um, I will let you run because that's game over. Not game over. Half is over now. I'm not going to call timeouts for you guys. So, yeah. Um, they did manage to clock four. We just don't have time. We cannot run the ball successfully enough to keep going to it. We can't pass the ball successfully enough, or we can't have enough. Much. We don't have time in the pocket enough for us to keep, like, looking for deep passes. And nothing, there's no success on this team right now. They're nowhere. The offense sucks. Uh, defense can't stop anything. We I think we had them, we stopped them once today. Other than that, they have scored every time. Like, I really want to know what to do. Like, do you see what I mean? Like, there's nothing I can really do about this run. Like I said, they can run it every time and it's going to be over. Now you're going to go to run here as he's in the zone. It'll be stupid not to go for him. Now actually don't go for the run. 
Are you serious? And no one's gonna catch him, bro. <laughs> like, I don't know what to do. This offense is just really bad. I guess it's just year one. Like I said, going from franchises where you're usually dominant or you're usually in the games most of the time to a franchise when you're just outmatched in every way. And I don't even think it's slides. I just think our team is just not good. Like, I wouldn't blame slides, but it has nothing to do with slides. Just like, we just don't have a really... We don't have one good position on this team. That we can point out and say, yeah, he's a man at this position. No, a quarterback, running back... Wide receiver, kind of, but not really, because these are more deep threats. And with the quarterback we have, we can't even use him as a deep threat because he can't. He doesn't have time in the pocket. He can't get the ball there. And when he does get the ball there, it's inaccurate. Under pressure, it's like, it's one of those things. Look, overthrown. For what? It's literally not a deep, like, it's not a deep route. It's a short route. Not short. It's like more of a medium route. So why can't he, like, get those throws off? I don't get it. Look at this. There you go. Biggest yards of the fucking day for this team. Puts him 9 for 20, 134 yards. 28 yards run after catch. Oh, wow. It's got a lot of yards from that. There we go. Successful runs here. I think this is a classic run call. Just please block for me. We got that ball across. We definitely got that ball across. No way they're saying inches. I'm not. I'm not doing that. You cannot be telling me inches right there, bro. Please. He jumped, he jumped, he jumped. Please tell me he jumped. I'm going to say offense. Why did I do that? Why did I not just run the ball? I try to get him also. We have to go for this, bro. We need a touchdown. Oh my God, thank you, Gordon. Thank you so much. And on the one, only gained a yard, somehow didn't get in right there. All right, we're gonna try to get in. And they're coming out in a very heavy, like blitzing type of thing. Obviously gonna throw right here. I hate Jericho so fucking much. You don't understand. I really hate this man. Please get this run. Please get this run. Thank you. Golly, Jericho, if you are so shit. So shit. I threw it before anything could affect you, and it's like you still didn't get it. At least we fucking get points right here. 7 to 21. Defense. Please. Please. Like, we just need some stops. Some stops. I could, like, I could struggle with the offense for the entire game. I just need some help on defense. I think it just spun out two people to lose five yards on that. Like. I'm just straight at the middle. No, no one gets in because our team cannot block shed. And with no block shed, it means we have the worst run defense in the league. And that is true. We do have the worst run defense in the league. There we go. Tackle for loss. There we go. And he's out of the zone. Great. Yard 
I don't know. I just really do not fucking know what to do with this team, bro. I just do not. Where are you? Why are you like two yards behind him? And he's fucking gone, bruh. This like it's so annoying because it's like they're getting the most shit that like I'm trying to cover I'm trying my asshole good sack like I'm really trying and we're coming over sack sometimes it was like it's just not enough because we can't stop the team that's the whole point of us not being able to stop them and it's like I'm trying to cover what I can obviously we're going to give up things here and there but it's like I'm really trying like if you see me on the coverage on the field like I'm like really trying my ass off with this like, do you see that I cannot cover both of those routes cause there's no safety up there that's gonna actually contain that uh whatever it is Like, you can, like, break it up sometimes, bro. And he's cheering because he stopped him on third down. Yeah, but they're going to get three. So what are you really cheering for? We're still going to be down. Uh, just a difficult team, man. And they're, like, two and six. So it's like, I don't know. I feel like we only beat good teams and lose to the worst teams. So, whatever. I did not want to run another screen, but fuck it, we're here. Can you juke somebody out, bro? Didn't you just get, like, upgraded jukes? Sometimes I wonder how do I lose so many yards on passes. Now look at the passes I'm making. Nah, okay. It makes sense. I'm gonna run here because why the fuck not? Like, what's really stopping me? Oh, that's what's stopping me. The, the uh, DR. We're gonna go for it because once again we have no fucking choice but to go for it. So why not? It's just you know it's gonna be it's gonna be a hold. They're going to decline because... Big hit. No fumbles at third down on third and six. I would say let's see how we come out and stop them. But no, let's see how they come out and convert against us. How about you catch the ball and run it back and get a pick fucking six? That'll motivate the team a lot. Right? Oh, we actually do gain some yards. I don't want to go out of bounds, but okay. There we go. How about you step in front of the guy that's in front of me and give me a block. It's just so overthrown. There is literally no pressure on this man. Can we look at this again? No pressure on this man. He was throwing in the middle of the field. Uh, just end it, man. All right, game over, game over, game over. Get me out of here. Um, 
Drago played horrible. I am going through these stats really quick because I do not care. Dak Prescott missed, what, two throws on the game? 220, 25 yards, one touchdown. Uh, Jared Goff missed a lot of throws on the game, threw for 33. Uh, he threw 33 times, threw 20, 222 yards, three interceptions. Just more interceptions on Jared Goff. Trey Coldwell didn't play horrible, but as he only had 12.4, uh, Dalvin Cook could have had 500 yards on the game. This team sucks. Um, yeah, I'm done. I can't wait till the season's over and we either... Let me get rid of Jerry Goff, because if you do not have abilities on this man, he is horrible, bro. Oh my goodness, like, anybody would be better. Maybe I should have traded you with Derrick Henry. Media questions, what are they asking me? You're in 500 right now, and you're... <laughs> and you watch this team struggle through the first half of the season. Turn around as soon as possible. Has to be the mindset now, doesn't it? That's just myself. Um, no, it doesn't. Our team is bad from top to bottom. We don't have one good player at one good position. I said that earlier in the game. We don't have one good player in one good position. Like, what do you really expect us to perform now? Yes, at one point, we were performing above 500. At one point, we were winning. That was at the beginning of the season. We're in week 10 right now. And we are 4-4. Four and four. Is that under 500? No, no, no. Actually, it's 3-5 and five right now. So, it doesn't matter how we're performing. It doesn't matter what we're doing. This team sucks. Uh, I don't expect this team to be a playoff team at all in any way. We, 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 we just suck. That That's what it is. Uh, and we're facing the Dolphins, a division rival, next week. We just suck. It, 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 it is what it is. It's like, I don't know what the media expects from us. We don't have no breakout players. We just have contracts negotiated. We're 3-5. and five. They are 4-4. Four and four. Well, every team won except us. <laughs> I actually just lost. They won't move down 6 and 2 or 3 5. Um, yeah, next episode we'll be facing the Dolphins in Miami. Hard Rock Stadium, to be exact. And that's going to do it for us. Um, if you do enjoy and you want to get out of the season as much as I do, <laughs> leave a like on the video, subscribe. If you are not subscribed already, and I'll see you next video. But until next video. Peace. No trust, then no nigga put some trust in my dream. No success on the break.